I hear so many uh, people that'll say, God called me out from the status quo, or God made me outside of the status quo, or God didn't call me to normalcy, or uh, God didn't call me to the pack. Well, the amazing thing is that we can still wait for the pack, for the normal, for the ordinary, and the status quo to make us their pick. If God called you outside of those things, why are you spending the rest of your life trying to be the pick of the very things that you say that God called you out from? The call to the extraordinary is a very, very deep call. You know, because sooner or later you gotta think that the status quo, the normal, uh, what has been picks from its own. If you're called to be exceptional, you won't be a lot of people's pick. Your call may, uh, your call may uh, be the catalyst that you'll need to create or the catalyst to make you come to the truth that you'll maybe need to create your own system. Sometimes the call to the exceptional will call, call you to become a pioneer, uh, an innovator, a disruptor, a uh, uh, even an entrepreneur. Because some systems, like I said, they pick from their own. So you're wondering time after time why you're not the pick despite your skill set, your gift made room for you but you sometimes your gift makes room for you inside of a system that god called you out from uh, i'll try that one on folks uh it's just you know because i, I was listening to bishop james I'm reading this book about disruption and most of these thoughts are from that these are just my own personal thoughts but he did say something he asked why are we fighting the insanity and the chaos that reigns in our day with normalcy. We're fighting the tenor of this day, which is getting uh, more angrier by the minute. Chaos is reigning, and we're going back with the same old, same old. For us to make constructive, substantial change, a substantive change, it'll take us wrapping up our gifts. If you're called to be exceptional, this is the moment for you to be exceptional. This is the moment for you to start standing out. This is the moment that you start building some of the systems that will bring the change that's needed in this particular hour. So look, when you're called to the exceptional, you may not be the pick of the status quo. But if God bless you with an exceptional gift, an exceptional call, an exceptional talent. Maybe he trusts that you'll find a way to operate inside the system uh, if they'll allow you to grow. Or he expects you to operate outside of the system because of what he gave you. He expects a return to whom much is given and much is required. So look, you spent 15 years for your boy, your homie, your roadie, your sorrow, or your frat to call your name because they know your skill set. But many of those calls couldn't come because they have to pick from their system. Your giftings may represent a reality outside of their system. So I'm not saying disrupt the system, tear down their system. Sometimes it just means building something of your own, building a platform of your own, building a platform where you can be uniquely you, building a base, uh, building your own tribe. When you're called to the exceptional, we always talk about the great things about being called to the exceptional. The call to the exceptional also means that you won't be the pick of the status quo because the status quo picks from its own i hope that doesn't uh make you reticent to be exceptional
But look, the call to the exceptional has its place, but it also has its price. Be blessed.